Hello, I am David Newman. I am on the Holistic Review Transition Team. I'm just recording this piece to introduce myself, explain what I've been doing and how you can help us make the Green Party better. I am the elections coordinator for the Oxfordshire Green Party, where we have two councillors, 900 members, uh, organise events and campaigns all across Oxfordshire. Also set up the websites for the South East Greens, where I was campaign manager for the European election in 2014. I came to Oxford, I worked on uh, an appropriate technology centre in Kenya, helping design and test and disseminate uh, charcoal burning stoves that saved a third of the wood that people were cutting down to look on. You can see one on top of my bicycle, just behind my shoulder. It created a new industry. Later, I thought I'd go somewhere safe for a change, so I went to Belfast, where for 18 years I worked on e-democracy and ways of get, find, getting people to find consensus online, uh, even if they hated each other. We have found systems that worked in Belfast, in Northern Ireland, and in Bosnia. Since Coming to Oxford and moving from the Irish to the England and Wales Green Party, I noticed that we weren't actually well organised in solving problems, finding solutions and doing them. The, the thing that many organisations have, they have problem solving teams right through from the beginning is there an issue we need to solve? Have teams that explore the problems, all the implications, all the things they might do, then rank them and synthesize them and develop into a practical plan. This is how modern organizations, be it private or voluntary sector work. The Green Party is still stuck in the century models of government, just concentrating on the final step of decision making. So when I heard that the Holistic Review was looking at ways of getting more people involved in conferences, in decision making, in policy making, more than just a few who have the time and money to go to a conference, and we're going to experiment with ways of using digital tools to include more people, I grasped at the opportunity and have been working with the Holistic Review team and a group of volunteers to see how can we do active online voting during the Spring Conference. That means the people outside will be able to see videos of the conference and uh, vote on the same issues as the people inside. But as it's a trial, the votes won't count this time. We just want to make sure that that can work. And we can also do experiments in other things in the conference, perhaps maps of arguments, issues and differences, perhaps separate discussion sessions for people outside, facilitated by the same people doing it inside, um, perhaps uh, online and offline training, all sorts of things. And then maybe look at different ways of working together to produce better solutions. There's even people who've written software where people can, anyone in the country can collaboratively edit a manifesto. So that's what I'm keen to have get going now. And we are already fairly way into that. We've identified quite a lot of systems that we can use for voting. There are systems that 
to either in schools or conferences to get feedback, questions to speakers, and particularly vote on issues. And we've got a small team, but it needs to be a much bigger one to actually test some of these systems and see if they're usable enough for lots of Green Party people to use. So I'm appealing to you, come along, volunteer, uh, help the transition team so we can make a, a Green Party where everyone can be involved in running it, solving problems, doing things, decision, and not just a few. Let's include all 37,000 members.